more important for you, but malapit na po ang Valentine's Day at malapit na rin ang Lunar New Year or Chinese New Year. At uh, dito po sa Kababayan LA, oras na naman para tayo ay mag Feng Shui. Ngayong hapon, we have with us the Feng Shui sisters. We uh, met her before, Feilani. Ruben mm -hmm. is back on the show. Hello. Hello. Welcome to Kababayan Hi. LA. Thank you. And this time around, she brought her sister along. Si Didi Crew is joining us because they are the Feng Shui sisters talking to us today about how to improve our lives and more important for others how to improve our love lives first you know we've been talking about feng shui every year we talk about this but there's a difference right the ancient feng shui and the modern feng shui which are going to be talking to us today what's the difference well i like to call it old school and new school feng shui the old school feng shui basically has a lot to do with topographical features in the earth the mm -hmm. push and the pull of the energy mm -hmm. so that's why they use the compass mm -hmm. and then the new school feng shui also known as black hat feng shui which we practice i think is really good for the modern lifestyle which we all experience now in our daily lives and it's really cool because you can actually take your your everyday worldly possessions put them in areas of your home or your mm -hmm. office and make them work for you to create the maximum amount, amount of energy. I'm thinking, Didi, it's also more convenient because you don't have to research about in what time you were born mm -hmm. and w the alignments yeah. of the moons and mm -hmm. the planets and all that, correct? Definitely. But is it as effective? It's just as, effe as effective. Yes, mm -hmm. it is. And we don't have to tear your house down or rearrange <laughs> your, you know, make major changes. It's right. just we use our cures, enhancements, and remedies uh -huh. to um, help improve all areas of your life. And we have some samples here with us. We're mm -hmm. going to be talking about that. But I think it's important to um, talk about the Bagua first because that's the basis, the foundation of the modern feng shui, correct? Yes, the exactly. Yes. So each area of your home or office has the, your nine Baguas. And that's why we say it affects all areas of your life because that includes love, relationships, health, career, prosperity. And each uh, Bagua has a really strong element. Element. For instance, water mm -hmm. is a very strong element in your career section. Mm -hmm. If you're, and that's your career bagua, also known as section. So if you're standing at your door right when you walk in, that would be your career. Already. Already. Okay. And so in that area, water is the strongest element. What does so, it do? What will it do for our careers? Well, it, it just it, it adds more to your career, gives you more business, gives you more focus mm -hmm. in what career, what what life path you want to take. Mm -hmm. um, and then you don't literally have to put water there, although in a lot of Chinese restaurants, they have noticed they have fish tanks of water right. Right, as you walk or in. Or the fountain. Yes, yes fountain. Yes. Yeah. Or, you know, if you have shells lying around your house, shells would be a really good uh, water element. And very aesthetic too. You can mm -hmm. use yeah. it for design, oh, arrange yeah. it, and, and people don't yes. know that you're actually practicing feng shui. They think that sometimes it's just the interior yes. of the office. And you mentioned something, you know, the office and the house, it's the same. You use the bagua for either your office yes. or the house or the both. Same. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. It's exactly. like taking a bagua and putting it right over your office or your home, and it's always going to be the same as long as your door is in the middle. Mm -hmm. For example, the love, the the love. love section in your home is um, um, one of our favorites, can we go ahead and, yeah. is a pair of candles. The fire's an amazing element there, and if you're standing in your doorway, it's the far right corner of your home or office. Mm -hmm. Place a pair of candles there, and it, it represents that fire element. So you mm -hmm. keep the passion burning. Sizzling. Yes. What about for those that are single? How do they find a match? Put the candles there. <laughs> And you never yeah. know where you meet you somebody. Know, um, also, number two is okay. like the best. You don't want single items there because mm -hmm. you're just going to attract the energy of being single. Uh -huh. You know, so put things in pairs, like two pairs of candles, okay. uh, two, a picture of two people in love. Mm -hmm. Anything you that know. symbolizes yeah. love. Or maybe Anything. red, uh, red uh, uh, picture frame. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Red, yeah. Red, red or white, pink. And red, pink. Pink red, and white, and pink. Even is white is good for love. White is absolutely. Good. Yeah. Yes, we absolutely. We love the white Very candles. Good. Right. Let's talk about the red. Speaking of red, there's a red string here. It reminds yes. me of, uh, of, of Kabbalah. <laughs> Um, what we like to use the red string for is um, we like to tie it around any uh, water drains, like underwater faucets. It, it stops the f uh, money from flowing down the drain, mm -hmm. basically, is what we yeah. use it for. Okay. You want to keep that mm -hmm. money. So sometimes it. you open the, the thing in your sink, under your sink, and you tie a red string. Yes, that's you all you have to do. Open it up, tie yeah. it Does it have to be red? Yes. Yes, yes. why? Red. What does mm -hmm. red symbolize? 
Red is such a strong color, with especially the ancient Chinese. That's why, like, for, for instance, now for Year of the Tiger, mm -hmm. um, the best colors are blue and yellow. Mm -hmm. However, you can never go wrong with red. Because it's always I, lucky? Yes, I love to accessorize with red. Okay. It just feels good. It gets the energy going. It's, it's a powerful the, color. Yes, right? very oh, powerful color. Very powerful color. Okay. Yeah. What about the pig? We see a pig, a golden pig here. The Year of the Pig <laughs> is not the Year of the Pig anymore. No, it doesn't. It's Year of the Tiger. But what's that That's for? Um, we love to put piggy banks. Uh, money attracts wealth. And in your, if you're standing in your doorway, the far left corner of your home or office is your wealth prosperity section. Mm -hmm. And so we always like to place a piggy bank. Put a few coins or dollars in there, mm -hmm. and it just attracts that money, money energy. Oh. Mm -hmm. Loose yeah. change laying around your house, if mm -hmm. placed in a proper area, can right. actually attract wealth. Yep. Wow! And th this is a quote coming from who's the famous Donald Trump. Donald Trump <laughs> is a feng shui practitioner, uh -huh. and uh, he he always says, you know what? I don't. You don't even have to believe in feng shui for it to work. All I know is it brings me money. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> and we end on that note. Thank you so much to both of you. If you Thank want you. them to feng shui your home or your office, they do consultations that's the number on the screen call them and make your appointment now before the lunar new year changes you have the tiger so more power mm -hmm. to both of you thank you at you. Bon Cup of in la don't go away Mac Cafe Espresso Drinks. McDonald's na bang inyong bagong coffee house? Ang mga bagong Mac Cafe Espresso Drinks ay mabilis, masarap at mas mura pa kahit saan, kahit kailan. Why pay more when Zoom.com has lower fees than ever before? Ngayon, send any amount sa Pilipinas for only $4.99.